What is going on? I pay. Oh well, I guess this isn't really. This is a Pokemon fan out there video, yeah. My name is H. Trainer Josh, and I'll be bringing you episode three of Pokemon Diamond Nuzlocke. And um, yeah, um, I'm in a more preppy mood to upload because, as you can see, um, my um, I got my ROM to work a lot faster now. Um, the music is a lot nicer, and there's really no lag, so this is quite quite awesome. I'm also wearing a pair of headphones this time around, so hopefully from here on out my audio should be a lot smoother. I noticed there were some audio like glitches in some of my words. Uh, hopefully that's not the case anymore. So um, yeah, I'll, I'll hear my Pokemon right now. As uh, yeah, we grinded everybody up to level seven, um, except Cricketot. Cricketot will get the levels eventually, but unfortunately um, he doesn't evolve into level ten, and his only move sets contain Growl and Bite. So yeah, it's a little bit unfortunate, but it's okay. We will grind them up, I promise, before the gym, uh, just in case you need to throw something away. Because uh, unfortunately, Cricket Cricket Tune, I guess, by the time it does make it to the gym, will not be all that useful. But nonetheless, I do want to use a Cricket Tune. I've never used one before, so I will train them. Don't worry, don't worry, guys. As uh, yeah, we got Azo Fart, the Bidoof, uh, level seven. Did learn? Um, did not learn anything. Uh, I know he learned Growl. I take that back. Yeah. And then we also have uh, Fodlin. I'm about to go to level 9. I preferably would not want him to go to level 9 because our rival's highest Pokemon will be level 9 when we do face him. Uh, but yeah, Turtwig's looking pretty strong. We got Jose, who did learn Quick Attack, obviously, at level 5. Um, if you did watch the grinding montage. Then we have Andante. Still at level 3, but he, he will get there. In fact, I will probably put him in the front now. As, um, yeah, it feels good, man, like, having a smooth fucking ROM to finally play. Um, I thought I would only be able to get that experience on, a uh, Game Boy, so, yeah, now I got it on my DS, which is awesome. That was the, always the thing that turned me off the most with the, the DS Mume, but now that this is also smooth, I, I really am impressed, so. I thought my computer was just becoming a piece of shit, but turns out my, there is a way to fix things. Um, anyways, we do have the uh, quite the adventure to go on here in Jubilife City. As um, we'll probably try to explore. I really don't know too much about the city. Maybe we can get some cool stuff. As uh, what do you gotta say, to me, old man? Do you know much about Pokemon? I sure do. I see you are knowledgeable. I imagine you wouldn't need to visit the trainer school then. But do visit if you have the time. You may discover something new. Well, um, I will. I kind of have to. Uh, I'm training Pokemon. I'm sure that's what the other guy's gonna say too. Anyways, um, let's go to the trainer school, see what's up. As uh, we have Frank up there, we got, who I would imagine is a couple of trainers. Learning about type advantages, buddy. That's good. Um, I did not mean to, uh, <laughs> yeah, well, you can only have six Pokemon at a time. You mean as much as you want to carry as much as you want. You cannot 
There is a limit on how much you can carry in one uh, party. Uh, yeah. You gonna give me an item to hold? Nope. You do not. Okay. Anyways, um, okay. Let's talk to Frank. Let's see what he has to say. Hey, Josh, did you come to study too? I went ahead and memorized everything that was up on the blackboard. <laughs> After all, it's the trainer's job to avoid having their precious Pokemon hurt in battle, right? So, Josh, what brings you here, huh? You got some for me? You got the goods? Oh, give me yes, the goods. Yes, sir. That is your give parcel. Give me the goods. Oh, what the? Oh, thanks for the crack. Why are you two here? I like it a lot, but I don't need you two. Hey, here, take this, Josh. Take a map. Your map. Mm. Well, according to the town map, according to Urban City, you should be the next game over. So, there should be Jim Perfect the Raven Pokemon I caught. Well, I'm on the road to become the best trainer. See ya! Well, we'll be seeing you, Frank. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go take on these two trainers over here. I believe this guy teaches me hidden power if I do beat his Abra. So, let's do it, bro. As, um, you yep. know, see what we can do. We got School Kid Harrison on the block who's about to send out his Abra. I do not know which hidden power you have. Otherwise, I would stay in with Fondante and just kick your ass. Um, I'll find out. Let's see. Maybe I resist it. Or don't get, like, too hit KO by it. We'll see. As, uh, that did a lot of damage. Yeah, okay. Yeah, on Dante, you cannot beat this thing. Um, let's, um, let's not stay in here. Um, let's go to, I'll go to Jose here. Hopefully this thing doesn't do too much damage to me. Come on, let's see what you got. Going for hidden power again. That does 10 damage. Okay, well, quick attack should nearly kill. Okay, just don't crit me, don't crit me, don't crit me. God, Abra is such a scary Pokemon. As Andante does go to level 4 off of that battle, which is always, um, always nice. As Jose nearly goes to level 8. That's pretty sick. Alright, so I do know Starly, I believe, learns Wing Attack at level 9. Uh, I don't get hit in power yet. Um, well, first let me heal. Let me heal my Krikatai. <laughs> and my Starly, for that matter, because I just ass handed to my hit. I really don't know what hidden power typing that was. It might have been. It wasn't fighting. Obviously, whatever it was, it was just neutral against both Starly and uh, Cricket type. So, Church Hit probably would have taken normal damage too. But, you know, luckily, Abra does not have any good defenses, so it's just Cricket Tech's easy job. And, um, I'm glad. I, I am glad to have Cricket Tech because I was not outspeeding that Abra in any way. Anyways, what are you gonna do? Yep, let's battle. Let's do it. Do you also have an Abra? Actually, I'm not too sure if that's what she's going to do. As, um, she does. Okay. Well, I will take the experience for my my good pal. As, uh, it's, it is a level 6 Abra. It's a little worrisome. Hidden power, let's see. Okay, it only does 9. As long as Quick Attack 2 hit kills, I'm not too worried, but it does 9. Okay. 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 Let's calm down. Let's calm down. I'm not exactly the point where 20 HP is perfect. You do 9 to me. Just don't crit me. Okay. Let's quick attack you. Okay, don't crit me, don't crit me, don't crit me. Let's go. Okay. Okay, these Abras are a little worrisome. <laughs> I was holding my breath for a bit there. As Andante goes to level 5, Jose will go to level 8. It's not bad at all. And we beat school kid Christine. Not bad, not bad. Get $120 from that battle, too. Anyways. Do you think we should have... Uh, do you not give me... There we go. There's hidden power. I thought so. Alright. Thank you. I don't know if there's anybody here in this region who does tell me what my hidden power is. But I believe hidden power is base 70 in this game, so... Hidden power will be useful on somebody if it's big attack you can hold. Anyways, let's um let's heal up our Pokemon as on Dante. Um <laughs> all of a sudden it's not only five levels away from evolving, so gotta keep my eyes off of him. On, on him I should say. But yeah, even once Cricket Tune evolves, I believe it moves it to four levels, so just gotta be patient. Anyways, I believe I know what's up. Oh ho ho! You call yourself a Pokemon trainer, and yet you have no Pokedex. 
That is Pokemon Watch. Focus for short. Oh my, you are a rare cause indeed. Case indeed, probably. <laughs> you see, I invented and now manufacture Pokestops. Not only that, I'm now conducting the Poke Shop promotional, promotional campaign. I'm sorry. I'm not talking to you, all, clown, all you have to do is find three clowns in Jubilee City. If you can find them, I will give you a, I will gift you with a Pokedex. Alright, so if we find the three uh, Penny Wises in Jubilee City, we are gifted a free Apple Watch. So let's, um, let's do it, boys. As um, you are the first one. Alright. Well, uh, hi there. I'm a Pokedex campaign clown. I uh, let you out with my question. Can I have a Pokemon hold, madam? I sure can. Why, uh, ding ding, you are correct. Absolutely correct. The Pokemon may hold a uh, single item. <laughs> oh, yeah. Borsh! I'll try to give him a goofy voice. Like Borsh, some items uh, become effective as soon as they are held by a Pokemon. <laughs> well, berries are eaten by Pokemon as necessary during battle. Ah, uh, here you go, your Pokedex keep on. As uh, we are supposed to be the third clown, but I counted you first. Alright, let's go find the other ones. Um, that guy will stop me most likely if I go over there. The clown's up there. So there should be some more towards the east, I would imagine. Yeah, there's, there is. By the, um, I think it's the radio tower. Wow. Norge, hi there! I'm a, uh, I didn't read that book. Uh, um, just like Pokemon types, the moves of Pokemon also have type. Yes, sir. Wah, ding, ding, absolutely correct. If the Pokemon type matches the move type, this move is made much more powerful. 1.3 times to be exact. Norge, I'm just clown, don't listen to me. Here's your Pokedex key pod. As I were giving key pod number two, so now we gotta go find where this first guy's at. Um, I would have. I'm gonna bet my bottom dollar he's south, but let's see. Let's see if I am correct indeed. Let's see. Anybody here? I do not see anybody. Okay. Well, maybe he is more east. I didn't think he would be, but maybe he is. Do you have anything to say to me, buddy? Um. I'm good. I, I really don't want to be making any deals, but no thanks. Not all, I'm not about that gang life, you know? As I cannot find this stupid, stupid clown. Where in the world are you? Yeah, I am well aware of that miss. I, um, not that any of my Pokemon involve, fr um, involve friendship yet, but I am well aware of that. There you are, you were actually pissed. Alright, what do you got to say to me, buddy? What gosh, I'm a Pokedex can't make well. Let's go along with my question. Does a Pokemon grow by defeating others and gaining experience? Yes, sir. Ding ding, you're absolutely correct. Uh, Pokemon grow stronger by defeating other Pokemon in battle. Some Pokemon even grow into an entirely different form in a process known as evolution. Here you go. My gosh, it's your Pokedex coupon. Alright, epic. Now we can go get our free Apple Watch. Let's go do it. Hey, sir, I'm back with my three golden coupons. Okay, let me count your key. Oh, I'm sorry, let me count your key. Points. I'll use the Poketch here. One, two, three. Bravo! It's bravo. I return for these coupons, I present this Pokemon Watch. Oh, a Poketch for short, you know. I've already said that like once or twice, but you know, who cares? You can add apps to your Poketch to make it even more versatile. Touch the Poketch and the screen and check it out. As uh, you can see, this, this is the canon time in the Pokemon world. It is 10 18 p.m. as I record this, um, this here video. My uh, online classes for today, and now it's um, it's a chill evening, so I'm just doing my thing. Uh, any of you guys give me items? Uh, nope. Somebody has to kick me out of here. This place is way too big. The city is way too big to not get something free among these trainers. What do you guys say to me, buddy? Did you know some kind of Pokemon evolve when uh, by um, battling? When they evolve, they can take on completely different forms. Yes, sir, what do you guys say to me, man? Evolution makes Pokemon just that much more fast. Indeed. Like, um, my hair Cricket will eventually be able to play on the violin, so... Yeah. <laughs> I guess even, um, mechanically speaking, they're able to do things that they never thought was possible. What do you gotta say to me? Okay, set six Pokeballs in my belt. Yep, that'll do it. I'm also gonna have six Pokemon up here. You are the second person of some kind to be telling me the same thing. Right, what do you gotta tell me, buddy? What are you gonna say to me? Nice place. Yeah, Twin Leaf is a pretty nice place. Ah, Cube Watch City is nothing important to me, buddy. But thank you. What are you gonna say to me? Oh, your Pokemon's quite adorable. Here, try making it hold this quick claw. That 
Can we get item potentially? What do you guys say to me, ma'am? Isn't my Pokich quite fetching? Oh, that trainer would be simply lost if I had a Pokich after all. I'm glad you were keeping up with the times, lady. It's no good to be uh, falling back. Uh, heal ball, are you going to give me one? Are you going to give me a heal ball, bro? Oh, shit, I bet you're going to. I like making my Pokemon use their attacks. Sometimes when they get stronger, they learn new moves. These new moves, things... Um, these new moves keep things fresh and are a fun distraction for me. I don't know, Mr. Bug Trainer. There's, um... I guess there isn't too much variety of bug Pokemon in the Sinnoh region, so I don't really blame you. It's not the Unova region yet, where you got Volcarona and shit. I believe I can go up north, which in this case, I will get my encounter. Yep, Route 204. Alrighty, well... I guess I'll have... I have Azel Fort in the front. Hmm, I'm actually... Let me see my items. What is your speed? 10, 10, 13... I don't know who I should give the quick quad to. Um, it's actually better if I give it to Fodlin, I feel. So I'm going to give it to Fodlin. Alright, let's see who we're going to add to the squad. Oh, item up there too. As um, not including the grinding montage, we're about thir probably about 13 half minutes in this video. We found a Shinx. Level 4 female Shinx. Okay, please have Intimidate. Please have Intimidate. Oh, let's go! That, that's actually really, really sick. Okay. Well, um, let's, uh, let's go catch this bad girl. I'm crit it, as, uh, I didn't do any damage whatsoever. And I miss. Okay, this is quite the, um... I'm gonna name a Shinx. What am I gonna name a Shinx? Alright, I'm gonna throw some balls at you. As I got eight Pokeballs left, I'm good to go, most likely. Let's see. Let me see what I'm gonna name a Shinx. I know what I'm gonna name a Shinx. Um, yeah, I know what I'm gonna name a Shinx. So, Shinx, the Flash Pokemon. All of its fur dazzles with danger sense. It leaves while this bow is momentarily blinded. Alright, yes, I'm going to name this uh, Shinx Alibaba. Um, kind of like, I mean, Shinx is kind of based off of Sphinx, obviously, and Luxray kind of maintains that Sphinx like character. And, um, Alibaba is actually the name of, like, the toddler's, uh, code name from Persona 5. And her, her palace is, like, Egyptian themed, so I figured it's to be, um, it makes sense. She's got a serious nature, Alibaba, which is actually pretty sick. Um, I'm only rocking a pretty high attack stat for its level. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so, yeah, Alibaba, for now, only knows tackle, but that is an excellent team member to add to the team. Um. Yeah, I will absolutely take that. Um, so I'm gonna probably uh, I actually got plenty of time. I guess with the speed up of my ROM, these are um, these are casually picking up with the pace. So I'm gonna try to get Alibaba up to the um, up to par with my team. Um, if, if I don't do so now, I guess um, at the rate that I'm going, I should probably be able to maybe even get to Orbos or Bird City. Um, what I there's quite a few trainers over in the next route, Route 203, I believe. Um, let's see, are, is, there any, is there any other buildings I have not checked out yet that I can probably get to this? Mm, I'll check here. What, what's up with this place? Let's see, let's see. Yeah. Hmm. Is it the Pokedge building? Is this what this is? Yeah, you're the president. You're gonna give me a oh, they're gonna give me a new outfit. I think you're like a questionnaire lady. I'm really not into you. Uh, let's see. This might be a little boring, but I I I, I really don't know the ins and outs. The, in, the I don't really know the ins and outs of uh, Diamond. So if there's any free stuff I want to know, and I really don't know what the where the free stuff is at. So I'm gonna be talking to everybody so I find some more free stuff. Right now I got a quick claw from this area, and um, I mean I could have Sarabee there obviously, but why would I do that? Trash can is empty. I'm going to check all three of these trash cans, and there is nothing you can do to stop me. You know that, right? Like even if they were, oh, there's a fourth trash can. Are they gonna be empty too? Even if they were all empty, you know, 
after they put after the fact that Kanto had items in the trash can and um, in the SSN, I will always check trash cans. And it's the um, and it's the fact of life. Whatever, I'll talk to you. Hello, I'm with Triple F TV. May I hit you up for a quick interview? Thank you very much. Let's not waste any time. May I ask which Pokech app you use the most? The digital watch, I see. May I have you comment on the digital watch? Hmm. How does one describe a watch? Um feelings. I am um, a watch is quite uh it's quite good to have. Um I wouldn't say I enjoy it, but it is important. Can I click it, please? Here we go. Confirm. Yes. It is important. That is my answer. Thank you for sharing your thoughts with us. We'll be featuring this interview in an upcoming TV program. Please do tune in and see how you look on TV. Oh, hell yeah. Bro. I mean, should have told me first. I would have put on some makeup, bro. But, um, yeah, it looks like there's really nothing else left in the city. So I am going to move on. Um, however, we do have a pretty big fight coming up. So, um, yeah, it's something to keep in mind. Hmm. Okay, so... How much does my Starly need before he uh, evolves? I'm not evolves, grows. 69 experience. Okay, I think I know what I'm gonna want to do. So I think my rival leads off with um with the Starly, and then obviously goes into Chimchar, and I'm I have no rules on being able to cycle, intimidate. So I'm gonna do this. So anyways, what's poppin', Frank? Hey Josh, tell me you got a little tougher. <laughs> me? You don't even need to ask. Of course I got tougher. Look at these guns. All right, Come on, bro. let's battle. I'm just saying, I got a full team of five. I I, I got Pokemon to throw away in case their Chimchar becomes too much of a, of a hassle. As I hear, comes that Starly that I was talking about. So, um, they're going to be level seven. Okay, that's not bad. All right, Alibaba can spread the um, the Intimidate drops here. Um, having the potential double Intimidate core with uh, Spiravia and Shinx is pretty powerful. So, yeah, I'm going to go into my uh, Jose now. I do have about, I believe, five potions if things get um, worse for wear. As uh, I do get ground, but I should still be doing some decent damage with Crypt Attack just because I'm a higher level. Let's see. I'll try not to speed this battle up because it is kind of important. I do about 25-30%. I'm actually faster with my Quick Attack, despite the quiet nature. Don't get cocky, kid. It's not over yet. Alright, anyways, um, here comes another quick attack as I do about, okay, I don't think it's going to be a 3 hit KO, especially not after I growl, so, I don't know if he potions up in this battle, if he does, he does. My Pokemon's HP is low, this could be a close one. Alright, he, uh, it is his speed time, the quick attacks, and that probably is because of my nature, that's just how it goes, I guess, as, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to be short on the kill, for sure. But I don't know if you potion up. You do not, and I get the quick attack off, and I knock you out. All right, that is pretty big. I get a crit too, just for the extra measure. As Alibaba will grow to level five right off the rip, and learn Leer. Sick. That is actually super sick. As I here comes out here, Chimchar. I don't know if the Chimchar already knows Ember. I want to say it probably does, so this will be a bit problematic. I'm not going to lie to you. But I will want to get that Intimidate drop. It, that is very important to me. Okay. Alright, so if you do know Ember, this could be interesting. This could get probably pretty dicey. Um, okay, here's what I want to do. I want to say you can take one Ember, for sure. You actually scratch it immediately. And that does six. I'm going to Leer. Because I do want your defense to be pretty, to be lower. I think your only status move is Leer, so you actually can't lower. You can't make up for that um that drop. As now I'm gonna go into Azel's part. I want to say you can take an Ember pretty well. I'm gonna be spreading the love here a lot for sure. As um he does Leer. Um. Okay, so that essentially puts me back at neutral. I'm gonna tackle now. See how much I do. Scratch is doing how much? Eight. Crit cannot kill me next turn. Tackle is doing not a lot. Okay. I'm going to tackle again. As he keeps scratching, so I don't know if he knows Ember yet. As a crit actually might have killed me. <laughs> uh, 
there, but that's gonna put you at about 50%. My Pokemon's HP is low. It's gonna be a close one. Again. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I don't want to be going into my turn I'm gonna go and I'm gonna go into Starly here. I'm gonna find out if he does have Ember. Ember should not kill me from this range, anyways. Scratch does how much? I want a quick attack here. I don't think I'm gonna kill, but it should be pretty close. Oh yeah, that was close. As he scratches, if he crits me, I might die, but he does not crit me. As a quick attack will knock you out. Okay, we get through a pretty uh, tough battle considering none of our Pokemon were level nine. As uh, Starly will probably go to level nine here. Let's see. Yes, sir. And I believe you will be learning wing attack now. Yes. Wing attack is quite the move to have at this point in the game, so I'm quite happy with that. As we do defeat Frank. What just happened? How did I lose? This this is not fair. Yes, sir, you did lose. That's right. No, buddy. this that's is not right. right. What what do you mean I lost? They, they against the rules. But well, that's it. Uh, it's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm gonna be the world's tougher trainer, and you know it. The first thing I'm gonna do is take on the Orberg City Pokemon Gym. I'm gonna toughen up for that totally. Squat bar time. All right. Well, whatever you say, Frank. As a, this is a new encounter, but my Pokemon is pretty beat up, so we will have a roster of six. Um, I, I wonder if I can even get anything here, because I mean, I don't know exactly what the variety is <laughs> in um, the first few routes of this game. I know in the upper round I could have gotten like a Badoo, and there might have been some other Pokemon. But we did find the Shinx, which uh, honestly came in pretty clutch in that battle. Um, being able to drop the uh, Chimchar's attack was pretty sick. Like, let's say I was, do let's say I was doing like a wedlock, that wouldn't have exactly worked out. So, quite happy with the results. As um, what's my timer looking like right now? Actually, okay. Yep. Um, I'll probably end it right here on this encounter. Actually, and hopefully I can find an encounter. As we do have a quite a bit of Pokemon trainers to fight as well. So. That will probably be what we do for um, the next episode. As Jose actually leads the team on levels, but Fulin, like I said, is about 10 experience points away, so he'll be right there. As uh, we find the Shinx. Okay, hopefully we can find something else. Come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, this is the encounter. Um, we get one shot at this. And, um,. Hopefully we can get it. All right, go Pokeball. Come on, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Give it to me. Please give it to me. Please give it to me. One, two. Fuck. Damn it. I thought I had that for a second. As uh, he's gonna teleport out. But yeah, um, you give and you give and take with these Abros. Plus, I honestly want to say Abro was my only opportunity. <laughs> um, my only the only new Pokemon I could have caught. I could be wrong, but. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna call the episode off here. Um, quite the, quite a good progress um, with my team. I probably won't even need to train Alibaba, honestly. I could probably just grind her up with the trainers we have here. As for Andante, um, like I said, um, I'll make sure he is grinded up before the gym battle. Um, so yeah, don't worry about him, he'll be fine. Um, but yeah, honestly, at this point in time, my main guy that I do wanna be sure is up there is uh Fodlin because obviously we do want that for the rock type gym leader so yep that's gonna be all for me thank you guys for watching i do appreciate it if you have any feedback um just let me know in the comment section and i'll be seeing y'all later peace out